welcome you to one of the most iconic freaking one of the most horrific games ever in history Silent Hill 2 3 I mean I'm sorry I just got done beating Silent Hill um, 2 and I gotta say oh my goodness that story was so good that I nearly cried after it. And I'm gonna admit to that. I'm gonna admit to that. I know I'm not gonna say you know, I'm crying on the game, but you have to play that story. If you if you have not played Silent Hill 2 and beaten it and got the you no know, good ending, oh my goodness, it is so sad and just and just emotional. Oh wow. Well, further ado, I'm not gonna talk at you know talk you guys head off. Let's go ahead with new game. Okay, I beat Silent Hill 1, I mean 2. Um, I actually played this game on back, of, actually when I first started my channel, but I just didn't play it anymore because it didn't do well. But I'm just going to go ahead and put out one long ass episode. We're going to go with normal, as always. And Riddle, oh, I actually have a normal and easy. I did pick easy last time, so. On oh, Silent Hill 2, so. We're going to go with normal this time. I'm going to I'm gonna test my... Tuss my freaking knowledge. But I'm not gonna talk to the cutscene. But let's start this. Sorry to hear my fucking chair squeak. Where am I? Hmm, I do remember uh, this game starting off like that. Um, here's the thing. Um, my brother used to play Silent Hill a lot back then. That's where they really was the ones that got me into these type of games or games, period. And he never beat this, from what I remember. Oh shit! Whoa! Didn't didn't see that. But <clears throat> supposedly the combat is a whole lot improved this time around. Oh baby, you can swing! Oh, let me search around just a bit. But Silent Hill 2, you guys, that game was so amazing. That had to be one of the most greatest stories I ever heard. And look at this creepy, really infamous doll of Silent Hill. A rabbit doll? No, it's a costume. Is there someone in there? It looks like there is, but I don't feel like making sure. I don't feel like, make, like making sure. Hmm. So this is the HD collection, so if you have noticed any bugs or glitches, since that's what it's really known for, a lot of people are saying. It's a giant rabbit costume, why would this be here? Okay. Popcorn, okay. And normally when people think of Silent Hill, they think of Silent Hill 2. Because a lot of people say that's the best one, so I can't really say that because I have not beat this one yet. Um, I I have to say if I had to pick a Silent Hill that I really like, a Silent Hill Four, because I I actually think I played that one years ago. So let's go in here. Oh shit! Oh shit! Okay. Hold up, bro. Hold up, bro. Oh my god. Hold up. Okay, maybe it's best for me to run. Run. Shit. I did not expect to be fighting this so early. Ah! Oh! 
Did I die? I don't know, but I got an upskirt shot, I know that. Shit. Hold up. Okay, let's pause. I don't have a map. Ah! Uh. I'm getting nervous, you guys. Oh my god! Yeah, I'm definitely booking it. I'm out. It's, okay. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Shit, shit. Oh god. Okay, run. <laughs> Rule number one, freaking run. Book it. Book this shit. Okay, so select is the menu rather than. Okay. Items. It's a push play for self defense. I never use it, but just in case. I have one health drink, one first aid kit, and some handgun bullets, but I don't have a handgun. Oh wow, this is. Memo. I don't have a map, so that's my health. So. Oh my goodness, you guys. Boxes. So I am completely blind, by the way. I do remember some parts. I probably actually remember cutscenes rather than actual gameplay. So. So one thing Silent Hill 3 is known for is, you know, it's bunny and stuff. Which I heard that the reason why a lot of people like Silent Hill 2 so much is because that it was more of a personal story between James, the main character, uh, and like the pyramid head. But on this one, from pretty much from Silent Hill 2 and on, from Silent Hill 3 and on out, it went more of a satanic kind of game. It was all about more about like cults and stuff, like satanic cults rather than personal story, which everybody liked about Silent Hill 2. Okay, so let's go in here. Alright, it's broke. Oh my god, do I have to? I think I might have to turn around. There's nothing really in here. Lots broken. I don't have a map of the place. Okay. One thing I had no, it does look like I have a bigger light. From Silent Hill 2, that is. Yeah, I think I'm about to go back out there, you guys. Oh shit. Oh god, okay, we're gonna go. Oh fuck. Oh! Get the way! Get the way! Bitch, run! Oh my god, what is he? What is he? Uh. No! Uh. Fuck. Oh! I'm going up here. I'm going up here! Oh my god, it's broken and locked too. Come on, bitch, I'm gonna fight your ass. Ah! Ah! No! Get the fuck off me! Come on! Come on! Okay, hold on. Oh yeah, I'm not doing so well on health. Oh my god. Okay, uh... Oh! Oops, was that supposed to happen? Uh oh. Apparently, yes, it was supposed to happen. Yeah, I guess I was. 
Anyway, I'm coming home now. I didn't get that thing you asked me to. <laughs> okay. Okay, I will. I love you too, Dad. speak with you. My name is Douglas Carton. I'm a detective. A detective? Really? Well, nice talking to you. Hold on. There's someone that wants to meet you. Just let me have an hour. And no, a half hour of your time. <laughs> My daddy always told me not to talk to strangers. This is very important. It's about your birth. I'm not interested. Are you still following me? Do I have to scream? Sorry. I'll wait here. You trying to get that young ass. But I uh, don't Heather look exactly like Sherry Burke in Resident Evil 6. Heather's pretty hot though, I gotta say. A nice pair of legs though. Get someone in there. Hmm. So here's a save point. And this is really where, you know, the new say, the new uh, symbol of Silent Hill came in. This mark on the mirror. It looks from so it looks so familiar somehow. What do I know it? Where do I know it from? Where did it where did I want to see it? And why does my head hurt so much when I try to remember it? So here's a save point. So. Um I don't know if I'll wrap it up here. But if I do, I'll see you guys all in the next one, and I'll probably just continue it part two from right here. So yeah. Okay. There she sees. Oh, there we go. Whoa. Oh, okay. So I, I get it. I remember now. I do. I kind of remember the beginning, the beginning a little bit, just a little bit. She, she, she booking it though. Oh wait, what the fuck is that? Do you see that way down? There? Well, there's a mirror there. Not a mirror, but I can't open that one. I'm guessing yeah. From what I remember, you do escape around. From the from the back. Just ignore this freaking weirdo. Okay. So let me go way down here and check what's down here first. Just a door, huh? Well, that's helpful. Maybe I should walk around it. Never mind. Now how did this car park here? Get here. Still got the same noise from Sally too. But one thing about this game though, um, it does seem harder in terms of story understanding and pretty much anything else. At least to me. I, I don't have a map, okay. But, do I have any. I still have that switchblade or that knife. So let's go ahead and equip that. And pendant. Dad gave me this pendant. On my birthday is one of my treasures belonging. So she got a good relationship with her father, what it seems. I'm trying to throw a key house. Okay. Wait, do I still have my medikit? 
It looks like a dough. Now one thing about this style here is really going for it really went for more of a uh, brownish oh, brownish dark orange type tone, but the style here too is kind of a greenish black gray kind of color. When this game's more of a orange tone with the whole rusty rusty theme of it. Okay. Let's see what we can fiddle with in here. That's a lot. This place is definitely familiar to me. And one thing about Silent Hill is one of those games where you kind of gotta go with the flow. Don't know exactly where to go. I just kind of you you just kind of go with it, you know. For those of you guys who are used to like games and telling where to go, then this game not may not be for you. All right, so obviously that's where we gotta go. But let me check. Oh shit. For, tell you the truth, I forgot what they call those things. But they were they they were in Silent Hill 2, you, you never fought them though, so uh one thing with Silent Hill 2 that the monsters really the monsters really relate to the main character. Ooh, got some got some bullets, hold up. Had a baby, did you use them bullets? Yes you did. Where's my actual where am I actually my actual bullets? I guess it's just some tin, so I can't tell from here that if it's dead, should I call the police? Not like they believe me if I say someone been killed by a monster. She has that. She has that very, uh, you know, I don't know, kind of sassy attitude. I'm say it's definitely not human. I never heard of such an animal, and it's no way it's a costume. It sounds crazy when you say it, but monster is the only word for it. But it's it's a, a monster. I, I killed it. Indeed, you did. Okay. All right. So, yep, that's definitely a way forward. That's locked. Oh, it's unlocked. I didn't mean to go. Oh, no, 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 no. God damn. Oh, man, so many fucking doors to go through. My God. Okay, hold up. I hate when there's really a lot of ways to go because you don't know which way is, you know, progression. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, that's locked. Those are good. So, what I'm gonna go, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go through the exit door. First. 
So this goes up. I don't have a map of this area. Great. Oh my god, there's another door. I'm going to turn back around and go back down into that freaking um, area. So, I think this time around there's more actually animal monsters, I should say. Hmm. Okay, let's try to ignore this guy. The camera's freaking out. Uh, locked. Duh. Locked. Progression. Oh. Just leads back out here. Oh my god, there's so many places to go. Oh. Okay, okay, now I know. I know. Oh, you fucking bitch. This is exactly the way... go. Wait, I forgot. Oh my god, I forgot. He's stuck. He's bugging out. Wait a minute, which way was it? Was it this way? No, it was not. Ugh! Get off me! Okay, this way. Yes, it was. I'm no, I don't, it's hard to tell, oh, there's my supply, okay, so I got 20 rounds, great. It's really hard to tell if, uh, where you are sometimes, it's very, um, disorientating. Hope I use the right word. <laughs> Shit. I don't necessarily want to use my weapon because you don't know what I'm about to, I don't I have no idea what I'm about to face. What the fuck? Oh shit, what is that? Let's check and search. There's too many fucking doors. Uh, shit, okay. Kick, bitch. <sighs> oh, oh my god, I did not want to use all that. I got, so that makes me with 12 freaking ammo. Beef jerky, what the fuck? So, that's all I got was beef jerky. Processed. Processed dried meat sometimes is enough to scrap monsters. Oh! Hmm. Interesting. Is she looking at something? What is she looking at? Is that more? Hmm. What the fuck is that? I don't remember the monsters in this game, by the way. I remember like that one, and then that big one from earlier. And we have a save point, which is perfect. We oh wait a minute, we just got some hand go rounds and health drink. Okay, what is this? Something's falling between the table and the floor. I think I might it might be a key. If my arms were a little bit longer, I might be able to reach it. There's a huge pile of cardboard boxes on the table full of books. It's way too much of a pain to move something that heavy. Hmm. So that's our progression. So guys, we're gonna go ahead. It's a magic circle. I remember reading about it in a book on black magic. This is huge so familiar because I read about it in the book. No, that's not it. It's not the book. It's from the altar. Altar. What am I thinking? 
Hmm. So that someone has a lot to do with what, what's going on. We're going to go ahead and save. So guys, I will see you all on the next one. Thank you guys if you did watch it throughout the entire video. I really also so much appreciate it. And I'll see you guys next time on Silent Hill 3. Peace out.